Ready to work. Ready to work. Ready to work. Alright, what is up guys? Deport here from Deport Gaming. Welcome to another Warcraft 3 commentary. And today we got a matchup between the red human player. It's going to be TH here, bottom left position on Amazonia. And look what we have here. It's going to be a Blood Mage. His opponent on the other side, top right position, is going to be the... Oh, man. It's going to be the blue undead player. Uh, and it's going to be PCG123. Let's see. I think he went for... Kind of no, he went for a relatively quick D DK. No, it was actually pretty delayed. Actually, let's be honest. Um, Blood Mage picks up claws plus six, and that is interesting. The Blood Mage against Undead. I've seen it work once or twice before. I think it might have been TH as well. So it's it's pretty nice. Um, you just need to make sure you don't use it uh, at the same time the Undead has mana, right? Because then it'll just nuke you. If you're saving your units, that is. However, though, he's, uh, the mana drain, obviously, very effective against Undead. Undead definitely needs his mana. TH going for footies. I presume he's going to go for the quick expand. Very easy expand here in Amazonia. Well, very easy, relatively easy. And especially if he's got a Blood Mage, um, I think it should be okay. He's, he's got level 2 now, too, so he's going to have mana drain and banish. So that definitely should prevent a lot of coils on the incoming harass. And he's got him highlighted, and now he's going to head him out, or send him towards the expansion point. And I wonder what, uh, what PCG might look for here. He's going Fiend, so I, I don't think he's going to go for a Gargoyle game. Um, probably a Destroyer game, I would assume. Destroyer Lich. Heck, he might even, I don't think Panda's good against this. The Blood Mage especially. And we do have the Banish being used. Mana Drain, like I was saying. There's the first coil. He's going to get a Fiend. Or, I was about to say Fiend. A Footman. Mana Drain being used again. Again, we have a Fiend here as well. I can't talk right now. Uh, DK did get the item, though. It doesn't seem like TH is too concerned about it, though. He's going to use Banish onto a Fiend. We have uh, Ber Berlina Rut here. I was playing some uh, W3 Arena with him. How's it going, buddy? Blood Mage is three now. Expansion going up, and, and that was pretty effective. Let's be honest, that was pretty effective. Um, the DK harass is pretty well handled with a Blood Mage. Got the level two now. Ooh, Blood Mage coming in. He's going to get the Mana Drain off. Going for a Ghoul. He might get it. He does actually do some nice right-click damage with the Claws. And Footman going to be back here just preventing the Skeletons. And let's see. How's the dead complete? I presume he's going to go for a Slaughterhouse. That's got to be it. Yep, it is. Lich as well. Blood Mage trying to retreat from this DK. Here's a Banish, though. He might get a Banish surround. There's a block from a Footy. He can use another Banish, too. There it is. He's trying to get the surround. And is he going to grab it? It's going to be close. There's another banish. He'll have the staff at TP, though, I presume. Maybe he won't even buy it just yet. He's going to attack the creeps, actually. Mana Drain being used. And DK able to squeeze on out of there. But it's close. And he's not giving up. He's got another banish. Oh, no. He didn't get the staff either. And now it might be forced to TP. Man. DK is going to be forced to TP here. Nice pick up there for TH. Let's see here. We do see the Shredder out. Arcane Vault. The TH style. What's good with uh, Blood Mage? Might go for the Tri Hero and definitely just texturate the castle, I would presume. I don't think at this point it's. I don't think it's a caster game, this. With the Blood Mage. I could be wrong, though. I don't see the Blood Mage too often. 
So I'm not too familiar with what win. units TH really likes to go for. Job's done. It's pretty good though, obviously, with like Griffins. Job's done. However, though, is he able to defend this? He's only tier one. The DK is pretty low though. Managing onto Lich. Lich might need to use a nuke. Oh, a little bit too late. No, he got it off. Now the banish proceeds. <laughs> Fiends can't do much. Managing again. And the footies with defend should be able to defend this. He's got a few more fiends though, and his statue out, so. He's staying hold of the dead. For the time being. PCG. Trying to put a lot of pressure here. It's only an arcane tower, so he can. Job's done. Footmen don't do too much damage, but don't take too much damage in return. Is he going to be able to save with the Banish? Manager in again. Now he's going for the Lich. DK does have enough, or not enough for a coil, rather. And now definitely doesn't have enough. TH, halfway, about halfway to keep. More Footmen coming out as well. And I don't know, can he hold this off? I think he will be able to. It's going to be close, though. Tower's not being upgraded. So if TH is not careful, PCG might be able to put a lot of pressure here. He's got the statues too for mana. He's staying in Halls of the Dead and going for a lot of fiends. Blacksmith being used, and now TH, he's bringing a couple of militia to help defend against this. Using the banish to help micro his units. Managing being used, DK smartly is going to back off. And he's going to be close to having a coil. And now this Blood Mage is in dangerous range. He's going to get Frost Nova. Does uh, DK have enough for a coil? No, not yet. He should have it soon. Mana Drain, though, can start kicking in. He's going to be canceled. Wow, he's getting low. DK, DK has enough for a coil. Why doesn't he use it? There we go. He used it. And that's going to force a TP on Blood Mage. Upgrade complete. Job done. Now look at this though, he, he actually did get the two towers up, so that's going to be very helpful. It's a one upgrade, but I think maybe he has enough fiends to take this down. TH though, coming back in with his, uh, he doesn't have enough for uh, Frost Nova, so Blood Mage should be okay. And if TH is able to hold this off, he might be okay, especially once he gets the Mountain King involved. Yeah, and these towers, they're tough to take down with the, the armor upgrade. Another fiend coming in. PCG still staying holes of the dead though. Really committing attack. to this tier two push. The fiend's getting pretty low without coils. Managing being used again. Yeah, it's really effective against undead. They don't have mana, they can't really capitalize on the banish. Oh boy, TH cut a surround on DK and he's in trouble. It's gonna fall. Banish onto the footy. Oh, he got out, actually. What happened there? I'm not sure why he just got out, but that was not good. <laughs> DK, I thought he was down for sure. Still, some exchange. Slow damage being uh, distributed, and that's the Mountain King I was talking about. So he finally has. I'll check the uh, TH base in a moment. There's a coil. Finally, a coil. We haven't seen a coil in like a year. Fiend is gonna fall now. Second one's gonna fall as well, most likely to the next uh, Stormbolt. There it is, and it's down. And this Mountain King making the huge difference. A lot of towers being made. Footman ready to come back and get some healing. Done. Horses are under attack. Upgrade complete. Thanks, uh, Janchua. Thanks for the comment. Glad, uh, glad you like the commentaries. DK finally close to three. However, he might be able to break through this. He needs to send the heroes over. Trying to heal it up. Is it too late? It is. Let's see, though. Is he still hauls the dead? And you gotta be. He, he still hauls the dead, so he's really, really committing to this. He might be able to grab it though. 
if TH is not careful, if he gets a a nuke on to a and with these statues, he's getting a lot of mana back, so and he's three now, that's critical. That nuke is gonna hurt now, and he's got a, a meat wagon, so maybe staying this tier two is is the right call here for PCG. Another meat wagon as, in, as well. And TH not anywhere close to getting his uh, tier two armor yet. He's going casters. Blacksmith being taken down. Not gonna get the upgrade too for his footies. And it's looking good now. It looked shaky at first, but now PCG recovering, getting his footing, and able to push back this TH army. There's the Frost Nova. DK's gonna get bolted. However, though, Blood Mage actually gonna have to use a potion of healing. Giving mana to MK now. That's a lot of mana, all of it, basically. Gonna be use a uh, Dark Ritual there on a Fiend just to deny that. MK doesn't have enough yet for another coil. Oh, ooh, he could be targeted. Not enough mana, though. Footy's still going after these Meat Wagons. They're slow. Three Meat Wagons, actually. There's a Stormbolt onto a Lich. We do see two Breakers out. There's a lot of mana on MK, actually, now. Onto Lich. There's no Death Coil. Lich might be taken down, and it is. It's down. Strombolt onto a Fiend now. It's getting close to a Coil. So the uh, Blood Man needs to be a little careful. Yeah, that's a lot of gold. 1.5k for TH. And he is tier 3, or trying to get Castle. He's probably going to go for Paladin, right? Uh, Spellbreakers. And here we go. TH Army coming in again, going for the Meat Wagon. Oh, wow. He already lost the Town Hall, though. And that's a nice pickup for PCG, even though he lost his Lich. Might lose a Fiend. It's down. That's a level 4 Blood Mage. No mana on DK. Mountain King has one more Bolt. Not going to use it on this Fiend. He's going to use it on... The one to the left might be able to pick it up with a bash. Nope, he's going to be conservative and head back, taking a lot of damage. We do have Lich out. Did he get that back from Tavern? He may have. Because no mana, a little damage too. He got Burrowed Crypt now. Should be able to chase down a Breaker. Ghoul's coming in. He got one. And now it's on to the main base. Can TH hold this off? He did bank a lot. That's the Paladin I was talking about. And he's going Breaker's Tri Hero, it appears. 1 1 upgrade. 0 0, but he's trying to upgrade Blacksmith. Let's see. Stormbolt on to Lich to start things off. And once his Paladin gets out, it should be very helpful. However, he's having very big issues getting some healing onto his heroes. And PCG, these Meat Wagons are already taking down the shop. Now they're going to go for the altar. That might be good. Yeah, if they take that down, that's going to be huge to prevent that Paladin from coming out. That literally is huge. And I think he'll be able to grab it. Oh, it's going to be really super close. Still skirmish going here. Mountain King has mana again. No mana on the heroes of DK. Whoa, wait, whoa. Oh, I was going to say, all the fiends are missing. Another death. Uh, was it a Dark Ritual being used onto a fiend? Reveal being used now. Smart here for TH. Going to find a couple of fiends. And another fiend's gonna fall. And these breakers doing work now. He did take down the altar like I was talking about, so that is huge. He didn't need that paladin coming out. So that was a nice pickup there for PCG. But now TH is pumped out. So many breakers, it's an issue. Mountain King's a target. But now, ooh, DK could get surrounded maybe. It looks like he's got a semi-surround. He needs to move his ghoul. He got bashed though, but he returned it. He finally had enough uh, mana for the Lich. Got the Frost Nova. Chases onto the DK. Now he gets the surround on Lich. Lich in trouble. No mana. And now Lich is going to fall. Lich is down. Oh, he got a level, so he survived for just an extra second. So pretty back and forth here. But I think TH is looking good. Still got his towers over here. And yeah, this is tough. Uh, PCG really has no mana this whole game. Even with the statues constantly trying to give him mana. Meat Wagon's gonna fall. 
And does TH just stay? I think he just stays Breakers. I'm trying to make the Ultra Kings again. Yeah, Breakers definitely probably the... I mean, PCG having really big. And, and considering the Breakers also take away mana too, it's it's a pretty good combination. Ooh, he actually used a Dark Ritual. Frost Nova Coil! Oh no, is he going to get it? He got it! Is that the Game Changer? doesn't have the altar yet. He has the Mountain King back, but wow, can PCG capitalize here? Is that is that the play he needed? Dark Ritual onto a Fiend. Unexpected. There's a Frost Nova again, and he's going to take down MK. Oh no, this could be disastrous. And it's down! Wow, what a turn of events. He got both heroes. Blood Mage is trying to be made back. And holy cow, what it thought to be a game for TH, I thought he was in the driver's seat. Now he's in trouble. Farms can be taken down. Is PCG, he's no destroyers coming. He's only at Hall of the Dead still. Breaker's desperately trying to take down this Meat Wagon. Meat Wagon's really the best uh, unit here. He needs to take down the Ultras and kind of open. I think I think PCG might should maybe commit for it. And for smartly done there for TH, taking down that meat wagon. We have another one coming out relatively soon. He's waiting for Breaker. He's got his Mountain King. And Blood Mage should be back. And he does have the Tyrant Hall back open again. However, does he have enough? Oh, he's got a nuke. He got it! Is he going to get Mountain King again? Wow. He got the Mountain King once again. TH making some mistakes here. Although Blood Mage should be back. And now he's making Mountain King. He's already queuing him up. He does have the expansion, though. And I hope PCG scouts it out soon. Now he's going for the Blacksmith. I wonder if... Uh... Okay, I was going to say. TH is at... He has 72 food max. Meat Wagon is here. I think a second one. No, it's a Fiend, actually. Now he's going for the Altar. Oh, can he take this down before... If Blood Mage... If, if this is taken down before Blood Mage, I think Blood Mage will get out, though. Man, what if he just focused that like a second earlier? That probably would have been game. Yeah, it'd be interesting though that PCG staying tier 2 this whole time. It's turning out okay. Our town is under sea. All right. The gold mine's getting pretty low. About 1k left for both players. Mountain King, he's back from the tavern again. Uh, We have enough for... A Frost Nova and a Coil soon. And now he's going back to the expansion points. Meat Wagon. He has two of them now. And here we go. TH re-engaging here. He doesn't have much mana on his MK. Barely any. Now he staffs though. He's staffing back a few of his breakers to keep them alive. Though, this Town Hall falls very quick with these Meat Wagons. And that MK needs to be careful. He's got a new gun to Lich as well as DK now. Frost Nova onto MK. He might lose a Meat Wagon. There's a Death Coil. And Stormbolt Exchange. And these Breakers really committing. He lost one. Might lose two. He will grab the Meat Wagon, though, it appears. The Lich is four now. Two Breakers for a Meat Wagon. Mana Burn, or Mana Drain, for the onto the Lich. Wow. Did he, he must have used Dark Ritual again. Dark Ritual into Frost Nova, and these surprise Dark Rituals, just, man, devastating to TH. Not respecting the Dark Ritual possibility at all. He's got enough for one more Frost Nova. And here we go, he's going to use it onto the Blood Mage. Doesn't have enough for a Coil. Mana Drain being used. And maybe, though, he could... He has to be careful not to get, take another Dark Ritual to the face. Lich is... Oh, Lich might go for it. Nope, not yet. Manager and Lich, though. He's going to have to micro away. Our gold mine has collapsed. Gold mine's collapsed. Our forces are under and attack. TH and both players don't really have too much gold left. I'm waiting for this nuke from the Lich. Is it really worth, though, if you don't have gold left to sacrifice a fiend? It might be. TH now bringing in the militia. So, oh, we might go for it. Blood Mage stepping up. There's a uh, mana drain. Lich gonna have to move back. Job's done. I like the positioning here for PCG. Moving back. 
Picking up what he can. Try not to lose a fiend. He might lose one. It's slowed now. He's got a sorcerer involved, actually. Managing being used once again. Uh oh. There's oh, there's an altar made back here. Finally, altar finished. There's a frost nova. You must have used a dark ritual unless you just got enough mana. It's close now. Reveal being used. Blood mage is at five now. I was gonna say if that was six, he probably win the game with a phoenix, but only five. And here we go. Now it appears he's got two meat wagons. Finally, PCG able to fend this off, and it looks like he'll be able to take down the expansion point and send TH packing. Mana drain. Needs that Mountain King. The Mountain King Stormbolt is very nice, though. He's got a lot of breakers. Please be careful, though. I'm waiting for this. Could be close. Oh, he's going to use a Death Pack, maybe. Or Dark Retro, rather. Frost Nova, and it's going to be chased down, it looks like. And he is... Oh, no, he's going to banish. Here's a Stafford TPTH able to squeeze on out of there. Wow. That was close. That's one way to deal with it. But, I mean, that was huge because he has to Dark Ritual a Fiend, right? He has no more gold income. And TH sitting at about 600. The Undead Army, he's losing a lot. He's trapped a little bit. He's going to be... Oh, man. So, Mountain King's back out. And now this is disastrous. What looked bad for TH turning into potentially a win. Lich is down. Wow. He's going to give the mana to the Mountain King. Mountain King's going to go over Stormbolt onto Fiends. And that's a tap out from PCG. Keeping that Blood Mage alive with the Banished Staff of TB out. TH barely holding on to the game. Whew. He's not out of there, but it's close. And he's not giving up. He's got another Banish. Oh no, he didn't get the Staff either. And now it might be forced to TP. Man. DK's going to be forced to TP here. Nice pick up there for TH. Here we go. TH Army coming in again, going for the meat wagon. Oh, wow. He already lost the town hall, though. So he needs to move his ghoul. He got bashed, though, but he returned it. He finally had enough uh, mana for the Lich. Got the Frost Nova. Chases onto the DK. Now he gets the surround on Lich. Lich in trouble. No mana. And now Lich is going to fall. Lich is down. Oh, he got a level, so he's. Ooh, he actually used a Dark Ritual. Frost Nova Coil! Oh, no. Is he going to get it? He got it! Is that the game changer? Doesn't have the altar yet. There's a frost nova again, and he's gonna take down MK. Oh no, this could be disastrous. And it's down. Wow, what a turn of events. Oh, he's got a nuke. He got it. Is he gonna get Mount King again? Wow. Wow. Did he, he must have used Dark Ritual again. Dark Ritual into Frost Nova. And these are Dark Ritual, rather. Frost Nova, and it's gonna be chased down, it looks like. And he is... Oh, no, he's going to banish. Here's a Stafford TPTH able to squeeze on out of there. Wow. That was close. The Undead Army, he's losing a lot. He's trapped a little bit. He's going to be... Oh, man. So, Mountain King's back out. And now this is disastrous. What looked bad for TH turning into potentially a win. Lich is down. Wow. He's going to give the mana to the Mountain King. Mountain King's going to go over Stormbolt onto Fiends. And that's a tap out from PCG.